here with a uh, proof of concept video. Uh, it's actually already been invented before, but here is a piston escalator. Uh, an easy way to get out of your mind if you have a lot of redstone and uh, time. However, it is incredibly efficient and uh, sometimes it's worth it. Um, I will be actually building one of these in my single player uh, LP tour world thing that we're doing, the Minecraft with Iggy thing. Uh, that I will be building one of these in that world. Now, uh, easy way to do this, you can either have pistons underneath if you want to use a gravity affected block such as sand, or um, you, if you don't want to use a gravity affected block, just use a sticky piston. However, to save on resources, you can just use a normal piston. Um, this one's actually a sticky piston still, but um, you can change that as well. So, let's test this out, and as you can see, it is lightning fast. Uh, that is one of the nicest things about this, it's not slow at all, and that's if you delay it at the right timings. Uh, the only problem is, it's a real pain in the butt if you're going very far down, um, but from a short distance like this, it's fairly easy to build. So, let's show you the wiring here. Uh, like I said, this has already been done by a few people on YouTube. You can pretty much find it with a quick Minecraft piston escalator. You'll find people who made it back in July of uh, 2011. And uh, I don't claim to have invented this. I just kind of tweaked some of the wiring and uh, made it a little bit faster, I think. So, for the pistons that push you along the steps, they push you over. They don't uh, lift you up. These are the ones that push you over. Uh, it's separate wiring for all of them, which is kind of a pain, but kind of have to do it. Um, so as you can see, here is the button. This block has a button on it, and that goes down to this uh, wire here. You just bring up this redstone, and uh, then you have a, another a 4 tick delay on this redstone repeater. That will cause a 4 tick delay on that, and then you add 1 tick there, 2 ticks there, 3 ticks there, 4 ticks, and then once you hit the 4 tick, instead of adding a second uh, redstone repeater to every single piston, you just make a four tick delay, oops, a four tick delay piston, or not piston, four tick delay uh, redstone repeater, make it go out a little bit, reconnect the wire, cut this wire so it doesn't interfere, and now that basically acts as a redstone repeater delay for all of these pistons until you re reach the max again, in which you'll just repeat the step. So this goes to one tick, two tick, three tick, and then once you hit the four tick, you just do it again. And it's basically the exact same principles for this side. Uh, basically you have a four tick delay repeater right there. That comes from the button that's right there. I'll actually show you it running. As you can see there. Um, you get the four tick delay, that's this piston runs off one four tick delay, then you have a five tick delay, six tick delay, seven tick delay, eight tick delay. Now again once you hit that eight max, um, the max on that repeater, you just make another four tick back here, the full max uh, of delay on that, and then you just re repeat the steps until you have reached uh, your destination fairly simple. And as you can see I have it demonstrated with both sticky pistons and with normal pistons. It works with both as long as you have gravity affected blocks for the normal pistons. So, um, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you guys would like a tutorial, feel free to like and uh, comment that you want one. I'm not going to make one just out of the blue because it's a bit tricky to do, but if, I, if you guys really want to do it um, and want a tutorial by me, uh, I'll do one, as long as there's enough demand. Um, anyway, if you guys have any questions or comments about this, uh, feel free to leave them below or PM me. I answer pretty much all of them, so uh, don't hesitate. And um, yeah, thank you for watching, um, and uh, see you in my next video. Bro.
Tschüss.